Good morning, good morning, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, my beautiful Virgos. How are y'all feeling? How you doing? Thank you all for your prayers. Oh my goodness, power been out. Um, I want to say almost 24 hours. Just now getting the power back on about, about an hour or so ago. Uh, it hit um, North Carolina pretty bad. Um, and, but I thank God that I'm here standing, you know, and, um, you know, I don't, that's why I say I don't take life for granted, but how are y'all doing this afternoon, this Friday afternoon? Yes, yes, yes. September the 27th, 2024. Okay. I want to say, I love you guys. Um, but I was just sitting here. And as I was sitting, I was thinking, because through the storm, I don't know if a lot of you have experienced some darkness here lately, some darkness. So you've been through a storm. You've been through some trials and tribulations that are all that we all have been through at one point in time in our life. And when you start to work on yourself and start to heal and start to become a better version of yourself tapping into who you are tapping into that inner soul of of yourself and you start to raise your vibration and you start to raise your frequency and you start to live a different life and you look back over your life and you look back over and you see how far you've come and where your help come from. And a lot of you, whoever you believe in, whether it's God or whoever your higher power is, I know it's God for me. When you look back over your life and you see the things that you have overcome, the trials and the tribulations, the darkness, the clouds, the, the echoes, the chaos, uh, uh, a lot of trauma, a lot of pain, a lot of hurt. And you sit in the midst of hurricanes and tornadoes and, and, and flood watches and, and you watch and you see how the world changes and how the, the things that you go through in life as, as Mother Nature comes into uh, reality for a lot of our lives. I am hearing you probably saying, Miss Positive Thoughts of Energy, what are you talking about? I'll get to what you're getting to. Yeah, let me tell you something. Sometimes some of you need to slow down because uh, uh, I'm saying some of you just ready to get that quick fix, ain't, ain't willing to go through what it is that God is trying to teach you about in your life. I'm getting somewhere with this, my beautiful Virgos, because... I am a Virgo, and I tell you, when you're operating from a high frequency, when you're operating from a high vibration, Spirit God's God, it says in the Bible that the, that the last shall be first and the first shall be last. Let me say this to whoever I'm talking to who's listening under the sound of my voice, and it was not a coincidence that you stopped and you listened to this video. No matter what you're going through right now today as I'm speaking to you, no matter what challenges you're facing right now today as I'm speaking to you, and remember, it doesn't matter when you watch this video because time is fluid. Time is fluid. This can resonate with you any time when it's meant for you to see it. But in the midst of going through a lot of trials and tribulations and, and being in the darkness, you know, sometimes God do things uh, for a reason. You know, when the verse, I believe it's in Psalms, somewhere in Psalms, I'm not quite sure, fret not thyself because of evildoers, because soon they should be cut off like the green grass, okay? And also in the midst of the storm, the Lord is my shepherd. Okay, I shall not want. Okay. Even though we didn't have any power for 24 hours. And, and I know for some people, because some people are not used to sitting in their stillness. 
Some people not used to being alone. Some people not used to, some people got to go, got to get up, got to go, got to go, got to go, got to go. And you don't know what it, what it is that when God, oh, God is trying to tell you to sit still and I need you to wither, wither the storm. Some of you want to just get up and get out there and, and you just, you got to be all over the place. And sometimes you got to sit still. And know that I am God. That's the key. Sit still and know that I am God. Through the whole time that God and that the lights was out in the storm and I could hear the whistle of the hurricane. I could hear the whistle of the tornado in the midnight hour. I can hear the, the whisper early, early in the morning where it was like 8 o'clock and it was black dark out here. No power, no lights. And I spoke to God and I said, God, I take nothing for granted. I am grateful and thankful for what I have. But in the midst of that storm, it shook me. It woke me up because I heard a tree branch fall. Like I didn't hear it fall ahead. I heard it. I heard it break. <laughs> But if you have ever been in the midst of a hurricane, in the midst of a, a tornado, a storm, that is a scary feeling. When you're in the bed and you wake up and you're just... <coughs> and I said, my God. And I jumped up. And I went to the bathroom. And I jumped up. And mind you, where I live, where, my, where, where I live is nothing but trees. And I said, I'm not going to look out that window. But I said, God, I know you said fret not thyself. And I said, God, I trust you. God, I, I said, God, I know you have that protection, that, that protection around me. I know there's a protection, a shield around me. And God said, fret not thyself, y'all. Mother Nature is real. And so... I got up and I went to the bathroom and I just sit there because that was the, probably the safest place I could be in my home. Either my, my bathroom or my walk-in closet. And I said, Lord, I know that I am covered. And I, and I got back in my bed. I said, watch over me, Lord. And I just, he just, it's almost like I was in the bosom, the bosom of God. And I just laid and I just went to sleep. And I slept. And I slept through the storm. And I slept through the the winds. If it's a very scary, a very, a very weary, like a very, a very eerie is what I'm saying. A very eerie feeling. No matter how high of a vibration that you are, that's a very eerie feeling when you hear the wind blowing but i am here to tell you that god said the spirit my spirit team my spirit team says that uh, in the midst of the storm in the midst of whatever it is that you're going through god said i just need you to stand still i need you to be still and and yes it's going to be a little bumpy and it may be a little scary but i got it, it, it is set up for a reason it is set up for a reason. And I looked outside and, 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 and when the storm was over. And I went outside. I said, Lord, I, you know, I said, Lord, I said, I got to go out here and I got to talk to my trees. Because every day I, I walk out of my house, I talk to my trees. I don't know about y'all. I can't go. I can't go up to my trees and wrap my arms around them. So I always go out and I always acknowledge my nature. I always acknowledge the trees. Even though I can't go and wrap my arms around the trees because it's so it's 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 back up away from my house and I can't get to the trees to hug the tree. But I talk to my trees. I I, I do I do I talk to my trees. <clears throat> and so I'm laying here this afternoon and and, and finally the power come on and and, and so I, and before the power came on I said Lord I'm hungry. <laughs> I said, I'm hungry, God. 
and, 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 and I didn't want to open up my refrigerator because you need to keep it shut so whatever's in there can stay cold. I said, but I'm hungry, God. So I said, let me find, let me order me something to eat. And then I looked and said, it's going to take two hours. Yeah, I was looking it up to DoorDash. It says it's going to take two hours, if not longer, for me to get my food. But let me tell y'all something, how you know that you operating from a high frequency, a high vibration, uh, where the last shall be first and the first shall be last. God, it, it says, it says, it says two hours, if not longer, of a wait. I said, okay, well, I'm here. I can't do nothing anyway. <laughs> I can't do nothing but wait, right? I got the patience, God. I got the patience. I do. So, uh, 20 minutes went by. That's how I, I want y'all to realize that when God is blessing you, when whoever your higher source is blessing you, Virgo, he's going to make a, he gonna make your path very clear. When you know it's of God, when you know it's of the spirit, when you know that you're operating from a high frequency, a high vibration, it's going to go smoothly. And God said, yeah, yeah, the man, man said it was going to be two hours and something minutes before I received my food. And and, and, and and God said, and, 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 I, and this was 20 minutes into me waiting, where the carrier that was making my food says, uh, your dasher is on its way. <laughs> your dasher is on its way. And I'm like, my goodness, you know, it's only been 20 minutes since I, since I put this order in. And you said, and this is what I'm saying to myself, you said it was going to be two and a half hours. But God said, the dasher says it's on its way. Now, I don't know who you are. And I don't know who is this going to re relate to. But you may not understand what I'm talking about right now, but you will come back to this video. I say in the next five days, Spirit Guys, God is telling me that you are about to be first. The very thing that you've been waiting on, God is about to move you up in first place. The very thing that you about to that you've been waiting on is about to become priority. How you know it is of God is because you are going to know because it's going to be smooth. It's going to fit right in. Don't you know I got my, I got my food. I got my food within 30 minutes. We're counting the 20 minutes. We count 20 minutes and then 30 minutes. Okay. From the time I call 30 minutes later. And the lady said, oh my goodness. When the door, the, the dasher came, she said, <clears throat> oh my goodness, I end up coming to the wrong. I supposed to got this other person before you. It won't let me close it out because I post that order. I suppose it got to them before you. You you uh, y'all get what I'm saying. <clears throat> I said, really? She said, Yeah, this order. I thought you was this order, but uh uh if your order was next. I suppose it delivered this order first. See, let me tell you how God spared whoever. You believe in. But the way I see my God. It said it was not a mistake. <coughs> it was not a mistake. God said that's how it's supposed to be set up. So whoever you are. God is putting you first. You are about to get whatever this is that you've been waiting on. And it may not even be DoorDash, baby. It may be something in the mail. It may be something that you've been desiring. It may be something that you've been waiting on. Whatever it is, you put in an order for it. And you've been waiting on it. And so, therefore, God is putting you first. <laughs> I'm full eating and everything else. Everything happens in divine order wherever you're operating from from a high frequency you're gonna know your frequency your vibration is high when things come to you like they're supposed to and i laid down said my god lord you put me first you 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 said no 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 it wasn't coincidence You've been waiting, and I'm getting ready to make it happen for you. And so whoever you are, you've been waiting, and God is about to make it happen for you. With the four of cups here, my beautiful souls, the four of cups. You've been waiting. 
You've been there's been a lot of dis disappointment. It could be uh, you could have encountered a lot of roadblocks, a lot of uh, disappointments, a lot of letdowns. It's something that you've been waiting on, and God getting ready to give it to you. So, but I feel like with this four of cups, you've been so disappointed. It's like it, it, when is it in my time? Is it my time yet, God? Is it coming? When is it coming? God said, I got you. But see, the thing about it, Virgo, you got to know that it is of God. You got to know it is of God. Page of Pentacles. You got to listen. Listen, the thing about it, when God delivered this to you, when whoever your higher source delivered this to you, you got to know that it is God putting you first. From being last. Whoever you are. Page of Pentacles. You're about to get an offer. A promotion. I don't see. I don't think you realize this. I don't feel like you realize that this is for you now. The spirit guys. God is telling me your time is here. Your time is here. Page of Pentacles is about a raise. A promotion. This is an offer. That spirit is bringing towards you. Virgo. You got the four cups in the page of Pentacles. This, an, uh, this is an offer that Spirit Guides is bringing towards you. Do not mistake it. Do not mistake it as another disappointment or letdown. Or do not mistake this as you think this is not the real deal. Because this that's coming in is the real deal. There is definitely an offer coming to you. The spirit guys, God has said, late in the midnight hour, God going to turn it around. It's going to work in your favor and around and around. Something is about to work in your favor, Virgo. Late in the midnight hour, God's going to turn it around. It's going to work in your favor and around and around. And around, yep, it's going to work in your favor, nine of cups, baby. Your wish has been granted, Virgo. Whatever this is, is about to work in your favor. This is coming from the spirit. Your wish has been granted. Even though you've been through some darkness, some trials and some tribulations, the last shall be first and the first shall be last. Some of you, this offer, this promotion, this money, something coming to you, it has been granted. It is working in your favor. Late in the midnight hour, through this darkness, through this storm, through this, this, this whatever you have encountered through this storm, God is turning things around in your favor. Ace of Pentacles. I can't make this up the bottom of the deck. It's going to turn in your favor. It has already turned in your favor around and around. New start. Oh, look at here. Let me get it. Hold on. New start. New taking a leap of faith. Taking a risk. Taking a chance. Baby, you're about to, you're about to bark upon uh, a nice, a nice blessing is coming in your favor. This is you making a lot, a lot of money. This is a big blessing coming to you, Virgo. This is God rearranging your life. And, and through this storm, even this, 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 this hurricane we just had, this darkness. For some of you, this was a test to see if you could stand still. If you can stand still through the darkness. And let me tell you, Queen, look at here, Queen of Pentacles. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Let me tell you something. You got the Queen of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, the Food Card, and the Ace of Pentacles. Oh, my God. I don't know who you are. But everything that you may have lost during this storm, everything you may have lost in your in going through this transition of trauma, Everything that you have been waiting for for the last nine years, nine days, nine hours. It's about to turn in your favor. Late in the midnight hour, God's going to turn it around. It's going to work in your favor. It is working in your favor. It's already worked out. You're about to come into some type of contact of, 
of a pinnacle. This is a large amount of money. Look at the pinnacles here. Some of you get ready. <clears throat> Look at the pinnacles. Look at that ace of pinnacles right in front of it. Some of you getting ready to get a big offer making a lot of money. Some of you getting ready to come into some money. Talk to me, spirit. Tell me more about this energy. Do not get it confused. Because you have been disappointed and let down in the past. Don't get it confused that you think that this is not of God. That this is not for you. It is for you. Virgo, I see your life changing. I see you in the Queen of Pentacles, perseverance. I see a large amount of pentacles coming your way. And sometimes we have to realize that when you do the work on yourself and raise your vibration, your frequency, God is going to show you favor. It's something you've done <clears throat> nine days ago, nine weeks ago. Nine months or nine years ago, something you done, you persevered, you came out of a trauma of a state of hurt, pain, whatever you done, God said, I'm getting ready to show you favor. I don't know who you are, but I need you to claim this for yourself. I'm claiming this, God, that something he is about to do in your life, late in the midnight hours. God was turning things around. Yeah, it made a it might have been very scary last night. These last couple days all week with this storm with God rearranging. Don't you know when I looked out the when I looked out my door? When I looked out my door, Virgo. You remember I said I heard a tree branch crack. You can hear it cuz the when you're going through a a storm, it's so quiet and so subtle. So the least little thing that you hear, it sounds very loud. I said, "My God, is that a tree that done fell? A, I mean, a tree that done broke." And when the storm was over, and I said, "I got to go outside, God. I got to go outside for a minute." And I walked out and I said, "Lord, and I see, I said, wow, I looked up in the air and I looked all around and see what tree it could have been that the branch broke in half. And I, and I still didn't spot. I said, well, it must have been from a frost somewhere. Then, you know, later, not too long ago, I ain't think nothing else about it. And I was laying in my bed the way my bed is made. I could see outside my window. I see nothing but my tree. And I said, was it that little tree over there that fell down? I couldn't see it because... It wasn't as bad as I thought the storm was going to be as far as the tree that, that popped. As loud as it was. And I feel as though God was saying, I want you to know that you are protected and that you were protected. Now, for some of you, you may have went through and lost a lot of things during this storm or, or many, many other storms. But God is going to restore what you lost tenfold. And I looked out my window and I said, God, I said, Ooh, how I know I was protected because that was a that was a pretty heavy tree. But the tree didn't come that far. It was laying there, but I couldn't see it. Because God wanted to see if I could trust him in the midst of the storm. Hold on, y'all, hold on. Okay, and mind you that the trees was just blown. When I tell you the trees is blowing, 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 the, the, the tornado, it was just, I could hear, whoosh, you could just hear the whistle. And I go outside and I say, thank you, Lord, for covering me, covering my house. So some of you may have had a lot of damage. Some of you may have been through a storm in the past. But just know that God was moving and rearranging your life because it's something better for you. And this is where this layout right here is that God is telling me, Spirit is telling me that your wishes, excuse me, nine of cups, all your wishes being granted. You got the page of pentacles and the queen of pentacles. I don't know who you are. But God is getting ready to start. You get ready to start a new beginning. This is absolutely amazing. Okay? 
This is absolutely amazing, Virgo. You're getting ready to start have a new beginning. You have been last for a long time. You've been waiting for a long time. And the last shall be first and the first shall be last. If you have noticed that if you're operating from a high frequency, high vibration, and you see how things smoothly start to go in your favor, God said he is putting things in your favor. You are... A, you are about to be up next. He told me to pull this this uh, sword of light, my sword of light out. This is from the archangels, and see what the archangel light is saying to you, Virgo. No more. You got the Knight of Pentacles. It's in the reverse. No more. No more moving slow. Things are getting ready to pick up. Things are getting ready to pick up, Virgo. You get ready to head in a new direction of prosperity. I don't know who you are. I don't. I don't know. I'm just tapping into y'all's energy, but God had to rearrange your life. Continue to be the real you. Because your greatest power, Virgo, comes from being who you truly are. Don't let anyone uh, sway you from expressing your authentic self. Spirit guides, Archangel said, continue to be who you are. Continue to pray. Continue to manifest. Continue to pray with your heart. Continue to be sincere, authentic with your heart. <clears throat> Prayer really can move mountains. I feel like whatever you prayed for, whatever you was praying, you was moving mountains. The storm came because you were moving mountains out of your way for this new beginning to take place in your life. <coughs> yeah, for this new beginning to take place in your life. Recognize the signs from above. The first shall be last and the last shall be first. Recognize the signs. Angels are sending you messages now. Don't get distracted for what God is trying to tell you, Virgo. Stay alert and open to the divine guidance. Okay? There it is. You will. You will manifest what you want. Priority. God said, I'm about to whatever you've been waiting on to come in. Here it comes. This, this is from Archangel Michael. Prioritizing something to come towards your life. I told you in the beginning. There is something that you wanted. It's something that is coming that he's going to make you first. And going to pull you from the back and make you first. You are a priority on God's list. You are a priority in God's sight. You are a priority. The first shall be last and the last shall be first. Whatever this is, it is definitely in being sent by the universe. Express gratitude as if your plans have already come to pass. Spirit God said, go ahead and praise them now. Go ahead and praise them and thank them now. Go ahead and praise and thank them that you already got it. Act as if you already have it. Go ahead and praise them now, baby. Go ahead and stand up and, and praise God now. Trust that your angels are bringing you the assistance that you need. It's something that you've been wanting, something that you've been needing. It has been granted. It's been granted, Virgo. I don't know who you are, baby, but it is time. It is time. Get ready. Your life is about to change. Ace of Pentacles. This is coming from the universe. This is prioritized just for you. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Clarification spirit. You are about to be set. Look at that. Grounded. Yes. Queen. Uh, the nine of pentacles baby. It's been a long time coming. But God is about to show you favor. Yeah you recovering. You hit rock bottom. You recovered. You're moving away from some rough waters. God had to do this. Had to rearrange your life. Had to get you out of this energy of selfish people. Selfish relationship. 
something had to be rearranged that so that it, so that this change can take place. And this change is a new beginning with the fool card. Fool card taking a risk, taking a chance, new beginnings. And learning the truth. Why did it take so long, God? But your inner self knew it, it was coming. Why did it take so long? Why is it taking so long? God said, I had to rearrange your life. I had to change. I had to go in and change some things so that I can make this happen for you. Okay? Oh, this is something people are going to be talking about. <sighs> yeah. They're going to be talking about this. They're definitely going to be talking about this. It's going to be the gossip, the talk, the town, something coming in. Give me clarification, spirit. You recover from being left out in the cold. Whatever this is, if some of you been homeless, you ain't going to be homeless for, for long. Some of you ain't, I'm telling you, you getting ready, God is getting ready to break, you getting ready to get a blessing, a mighty blessing, page of pentacles. You coming, you going from robbing Paul to pay, 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 pay Peter. Yes, that part. Queen of Swords. Yep. You decided to cut, cut somebody out. You decide, whoever you decided to go cold towards, that was the best decision you ever made. Because you realize you got options. Nine of Pentacles. There go that Nine of Pentacles again. Honey, you about to be looking very, very good. You, Yeah, you about to be looking very good. Seven of Cups options. Thank you, Spirit. Harrison, yeah, you're about to be looking very good. Any other message? Queen of Cups, Herman in the reverse. You've been in isolation. Some of you have been in isolation for a long time. Four of Cups, yeah. Don't get this confused. This is a blessing coming from Archangel Michael. Yeah, some of you been been impatient. When is it coming? Oh my goodness, so much energy here. Some of you been impatient. When is it coming? Spirit God said, don't get this confused. This is Spirit handing you this cup, handing you this blessing. It's your time now. It's your time now. Page of Pentacles. Oh, look at that sunshine. I just cut the card. Page of Pentacles here. Your sunshine, it is here. Your sunshine is here, honey. I don't know who you are, but your sunshine is definitely here. I'm telling you, page of cups. Okay, page of cups. My God, two of wands. Yeah, this has a lot to do with your happiness, ten of cups, with your fulfillment. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Virgo, I don't know who you are, baby, but God said, I'm about to show you favor, and I don't want you to get it confused of what has disappointed you in life or who have let you down. I need you to know because the signs, I'm going to send signs that this is coming from above. Pay attention. Don't get distracted for the blessing that God got coming towards you. The reason why I said don't be distracted because you done been disappointed so much from people places things or whatever that he wants you to continue to keep your eye on him i'm just saying prioritize yourself when this blessing come prioritize yourself i'm positive thoughts and energy virgo <sighs> things are about to turn in your favor it's working out in your favor it has already been worked out in your favor and spirit guys god said i need you to act as if you already got it because it's on its way and the thing about it, Virgo, it is being orchestrated. It is being prioritized from Archangel Michael. Until next time, Virgo.